mathematicians. Today's lesson, we're going to work on doubles addition facts. Hmm, doubles. Do we know that word? Have we heard of that before? Let's check it out. We'll use our tin frame today and some counters to help us build our mental abilities for this strategy. When we use our tin frame and counters, that helps us build a visual or mental picture in our minds. We'll jump in with 3 plus 3. 3 plus 3. It's a double because I'm adding the same number twice. I will build 3 on the top row of my tin frame and 3 on the bottom row. I have 3 yellow, 3 red, 3 plus 3 equals 6. That's right. 3 plus 3 equals 6. And I think something's pretty interesting about this number. It looks to me this number, 6, is an even number. Even means that each has a partner and no one is left out. We'll see if that pattern continues. Next is 2 plus 2. It's a double. We're adding the same number twice. I'll show 2 on the top, 2 on the bottom. 2 plus 2 is 4. I bet you already knew that one. Good job. 2 plus 2 equals 4. Is 4 an even number? Both of them have a partner? They do. 4 plus 4 is next. Let's build 4 along the top row and 4 on the bottom row. 4 yellow, 4 red. 4 and 4 is 8. You got it. 4 and 4 is 8. If we build this on the tin frame, take a picture in your mind. Click. All right, I've got a picture of it. 4 and 4 is 8. Next is 6 plus 6. 6 plus 6. Well, I have 4 on the top row. I'll add 5, 6. I had to go to the next tin frame. And with the red, I have 4 red, 5 red, 6 red. Now I have 6 yellow and 6 red. 6 plus 6. Well, I filled up the top 10 frame. That's 10. And 2 more is 12. 6 plus 6 equals 12. Is 12 an even number? Does everyone have a partner? They do. 12 is even. Mm, so interesting. Next problem is 8 plus 8. Okay, well, I have 6 yellow already on my 10 frame. So 7 yellow, 8 yellow. And I have 6 red. I'll add 7, 8. Now I have 8 yellow, 8 red. 8 plus 8. Filled up one 10 frame. Move to the next one. 10 and 6, 16 all together. Let's take a mental picture of this one. Good job. 8 plus 8 is 16. 7 plus 7. Oh, well, let's see. I have 5, 6, 7. Oh, I could take those away. Let's see now. Let's see if I can build 7 plus 7. 5, 6, 7 yellow. 5, 6, 7 red. 7 plus 7. I've built 10. Four more. It's 14. Is 14 even? Do they all have a partner? No one left out? You're right, they do. 14 is an even number. It seems that every time I add doubles, I get an even number. 9 plus 9. Whew. Let's see. I have 5 yellow, and then 6, 7, 8, 9 yellow, and 5 red, and 6, 7, 8, and 9 red. So, 9 yellow, 9 red, 9 plus 9 is almost the whole thing full. 
It's 18. I've almost filled up the complete double 10 frame. 18, nine plus nine is 18. We're getting to some big numbers today. Five plus five. Well, I don't need this bottom row because I have five yellow up top, five red down here, the second row. Five and five fills up my 10 frame. Five and five is 10, you know that. Is 10 even? Yes, it is. Last one, 10 plus 10. Do you already know? Let's just double check. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten yellow, and five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten red. Ten and ten equals twenty. Good work. We have worked on our doubles addition facts today, and we worked with the ten frame encounters to help us build some mental images or visual pictures in our mind so we can remember what these double facts look like. So keep practicing your doubles facts. You'll get better at them, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.